नमस्कार स्वराज अभियान प्रेस रिलीज फर्स्ट अक्टूबर 2015 संवेदना यात्रा टू कमेंस ऑन गांधी जयंती टुमारो फ्रॉम यादगीर इन कर्नाटका टू गिव पावर टू द वॉइस ऑफ सन्स ऑफ द सॉइल योगेंद्र यादव हैज चोजन द ऑनरेबल ओकेजन ऑफ गांधी जयंती टू बिगिन हिज संवेदना यात्रा द मार्च फॉर कम्पैशन फ्रॉम यादगीर इन कर्नाटका दिस विल बी येट ना द माइल स्टोन इन द जय किसान मूवमेंट ऑफ स्वराज अभियान The purpose of the yatra is to draw the attention of entire nation to the worsening plight of our farmers and as the name suggests to awaken the compassion latent in the hearts of our people and society. Many well-known artists, writers, storytellers, singers, photographers will join the yatra through the worst affected regions of the country. Official data shows 14% deficit than normal rains in the country. The level of rainfall in country's 295 districts is severely reduced. These districts account for 39% of country's total landmass. In the last 100 years, this is only the third time that a consecutive drought prolonged over 2 years has become death spain for the farmers. According to the Indian Meteorological Department's forecast, the situation is expected to continue till April 2016. So the drought that has destroyed the Kharif crop will also afflict the Rabi crop. It is unfortunate that the country has turned a blind eye to the drought that is now of the scale of a national disaster. It has already wiped out the lives of thousands of farmers but the governments both at the center and in state are busy in paperwork and making empty claims for the media and city dwellers also this issue has not caught attention it deserved such is our ignorance that uttar pradesh which represents the core of the crisis is not even being talked about we are fast moving towards becoming an utterly compromised and insensitive society The Samvedna Yatra beginning from October 2 will travel from Northern Karnataka through Telangana, Marathwada and Bundelkhand regions of Uttar Pradesh to end in Southern Haryana on October 15. Spread over 25 districts and 7 states, it will cover 3500 kilometers over a fortnight. It is essentially a journey through the villages in the severe drought prone districts of the country to reach out and understand the problems and issues of the worst affected families. and the prime goal of raising them effectively at national level during the journey we will also attempt to understand and document the alternative experiments and indigenous methods devised by resilient indian villagers to counter drought through this yatra jay kisan movement aims to present the true picture of the country's farmers and agricultural crisis to exhort and wake up the sleeping sensibilities of our society and to find the solution to this grave problem is the ultimate objective of samvedna yatra in solidarity with jay kisan movement many respected people of intellectual and art community will travel with yogendra yadav so that we can present the farmers plight in every stream and through their medium connect it to various aspects of the society and make it a topic for intensive discussion and thought process jay kisan movement will not let this drought turn into a famine To ensure that farmers are not left alone to face this disaster, Yogendra Yadav starts this journey tomorrow, October the second, to ignite and imbibe the nation's feelings of compassion towards them within his own self and lay the foundation for a better future and a happy nation. Jai Kisan, Jai Hind, Swaraj Abhiyan Media.